work with too. Yes, so that's get, the most important part. We're gonna start bright and early at 10 a.m. Eastern. So if you're on the West Coast, yeah, we give us hit that alarm clock for 7 a.m. to catch those early sets. So here we go, jumping in back into doubles. We got Captain Falcon and Ness being represented by Fatality and I. Then you got Tweak and Captain Zach. You just saw them earlier. We got Lucina coming out this time around from Tweak. Yeah, okay, I, this makes a lot of sense. He did play the character in Smash 4 on the super, super low, but he was yeah. really good with both Martha and Lucina. Like obviously. father, like daughter, man. Right, right, yeah. Sweet, showing the whole family tree out here. Yep. Next, I'm going to see a Robin. Yeah, that, that uh, mother or husband or you yeah, know, whatever. Whatever you want, man. Depends on how uncle. you play the game, right? Yeah, it could be, it could be the uncle. like. <laughs> or just the family friend. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Wow, the snipe from Captain Whoa. Zach. But Ai oh, responding immediately. That was so intense. Oh, man. Tweak and I both still hang, hang on to their first stocks, but I clearly yeah. this is favoring the blue team right now. Man, that was so naughty. Everyone was dying. Everyone is here, and now yeah, everyone, everyone is dead. Everyone is gone. Yeah, yeah literally world the light, man. Yeah, right? Like, Where, what, a, what a mind game. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you see Kirby just pop out after everyone else loses his stock. It's like, all right, this is canon now. Yep. Okay, there we go. Nice crown hit coming out from Gavin Zach in that forward air. Now everyone's at two stocks except for your boy Tweak, representing the Lucino. It's not, and that's what you gotta do on that platform. You gotta hold that shield, wait for somebody to come to you. The only one that's gonna be able to do anything about that is probably Fatality with his uppie. Well, Fatality hopping in the team combo right yeah, there. You saw it. Poor eye. And then he drops the stock. Man, uh, this is not his finest hour. Yeah, was that 3v1 for a second? Or like? It definitely was. It was Mario Party. Yeah. <laughs> My man fell on a red space. Here we go. Getting back onto the stage. Parasol. Another, honestly, Iko going in with these other specials. Seeing a lot of team hits coming out from red team. Going super deep for the upbeat kill. Fatality manages to get it. Gets the edge guard against Tweak AI. AI taking care of Captain Zack on the other side. Bringing this back bit by bit. Three stocks apiece, but Iko literally about to explode. How do you oh. get back to stage? I don't so know. close. Tweak just backed off a little yeah. bit. You know, the go-to is to counter Ness out of his upbeat. Right. Once he hits himself with Pika Thunder. But uh, it's not always that easy. It's all about... He wanted to try to, like, hit him before he even got a chance to set up the Pika Thunder. So it, it depends on what he's going for. Now early. He's going off super deep with these uh, forward air swings as well. Meanwhile, on the other side, you see Captain Zach trying to just keep pushing Vitality off. Oh, another one? Oh, yes! <laughs> and he's going to trade stocks! That was so worth... But uh, it was his last stock, so was it really? I think he was hoping that either A, he was going to make it back, or B, I, I would be over there to try to like bring him back to the stage. But I was already being, you know, a little bit of dealing with Captain Zack at the time, so. Yeah, Fatality probably just trying to make things a bit easier for his teammate in this 2v1. It could have been three stocks right. to one, but instead it's just two. Either way, not great odds for him. Tweaking Captain Zack playing with the absolute fury right now. Yeah, it's up between Rock and our place yet again. Oh, managed to get back to center stage. It's really difficult to escape that ledge against the likes of Captain Zack and Tweak. Stuck between two top five characters, man. Yeah, That's honestly. It's not fun. It's, it's, as Ness goes up there, gets the up air. I think a turn up hit yeah, he, as well. Yeah, he collided with the yeah. turn up on the way up. That so, was so super cute. The turn up got the kill there. So we got Tweak and Zack taking a pretty dominating Wait. game, number one. Fat I, I felt like Fatality and AI just seemed a little off. Uh, like, like I said, they, they were hitting each other a little bit. And there's a little bit of like synchronization issues, right? And other than that, though, I, th I this is I think they can bring this back pretty easily. Like, you saw Fatality bringing in the heat with that downer off stage. Just maybe if he didn't fast fall it, he could have brought it back. Or if he saved his double jump, I'm not sure. Right. And of course, these are the hardest opponents that Fatality and I have faced yet, right? Right. Uh, well, I don't know. Actually, Light and Iroh, <laughs> that's a pretty that's, formidable you know combination. So. Honestly, yeah. I don't know. They're both pretty even. Yeah. Uh, honestly, I might almost give it to Nairo. Speaking of uh, Nairo and Light, they're still in loser side of the bracket, correct? Yes, they yeah. are. So, uh, they're uh, probably wait, gonna be the next set. Wait, we'll see. let me not speak too soon. All right, let's check. I know I just read the matches, but you know, just double check. Caught yeah. up in all the action and stuff. Right. No, they are gone. They're gone. They're gone. They, wow. Where did they lose? That's a shocker. Uh, maybe they just have a team name and it's not popping out to me immediately. We got, we, let's just ban these teams, man. Well, either way, I mean, they, they're not in the bracket any longer, so. Yeah, so that, that is uh, pretty nuts. So we got the fabled Ganondorf coming out from Fatality, but finally busting out the uh, the dream character. So yeah, we, we thought we were going to see that for a second. Earlier on, you know, when we was going for those uh, little hand warmers. Now, again, these two were the ones that actually beat Nairo and Light previously at Winterside. So they definitely don't get out of the competition just yet. Trying to channel, channel his inner Nairo with the Ganon. Okay, yeah, so Nairo and Light got 13th place. They were in as Team LN. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. They lost the Cosmos into Buzz in a 2-1 set. Tough break, man, running yeah. into two really good teams. 
I mean, when you're that far in the bracket, like, it's going to happen naturally. Yeah, can't win them all. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now with Ganondorf. You, oh, oh, oh no. no. That was Ganon's controller? Wait a minute. Did his batteries die? Does Fatality even play with the Pro Controller? I think they're discussing it. No, he doesn't. He plays GameCube. How did that happen? Uh, I think somebody else. Somebody synced, synced it up. Yeah. Ooh. There's no TO around. Well, so. I'm not gonna say anything. I'm just gonna let. I'm just gonna let this rock. Well, let's see. Well, oh, let's someone's see. drifting too. Ooh. Someone's got their controller on. Yeah. I don't see a TO anywhere too. I think they're all busy on the mainstream, maybe or like you know. Um. I think they're just gonna jump back into it. I, I, Max, I think they just agreed to just reset the neutral. All they, right. Well, yeah. as as long as everything's working and yeah. it's not gonna get interrupted again, then I guess we're good. Yeah. But man, they, that they was just, unfortunate. Yeah, it was super unfortunate. It, it was pretty early on, at least, and no one was like in the midst of almost dying. So. There also, we go. Captain Zack throwing me off super hard, picking this red Peach costume. Yeah, right. It literally, is three v one right now. But then again, Ness's costume looks blue, so it's a. Uh, Tweak and I versus Fatality and Zack. Isn't this like a rule or something like that where you have to like pick a color? Like Yes, and I'm a big supporter slash Same. enforcer of that rule because, man, uh, it can be really distracting when yes. you just aren't able to see what's going on. Exactly. Probably. And that's going to be a dead eye. Just kind of throwing away a second stock. I'm not sure what happened. All kinds of chaos going on. Yeah, he was match. at low percent, too. He just kind of didn't recover correctly. Now things are looking pretty bleak here. Captain Zack sitting at high percent. We'll see if Gandor can find the Whoa. money maker. Doesn't matter which character it is, he's gonna land that down here. It's gonna find its mark. With the fire of the electricity, and he's dead. Yeah, no jump to speak of. Vitality down to his last stock. Captain Zack still on his first. Ooh, for not very long. Yeah. <laughs> not for long. And you saw Tweet go off stage with a counter against BD Thunder, and he managed to, you know, escape death. Gets back onto the ledge. Dash tag to just run, run, run right in there. Why not? Just throw your entire body into the chaos. I like these follow Fatality, trying to get a tech chase on Tweak, but not going to make it that easy for him. Oh, the back hit of the down smash. That is so ludicrously strong. And now we see Captain Zack down to his last stock already. Yeah. He just melted right there. You know, we saw I just kind of mess up a little bit with that flub, but easily bringing this back. And Gandorf might be the gameplay maker that, we, that we'll see. You know, every single time you see him in disadvantage state, he always goes for the downer. They got oh, the kill. What a pass. Pass from Tweak to Zack. Oh, Fatality a little too hungry there. That forward smash yep. definitely going to be blocked in time. No, and tech. off the wall. Off the wall, off the dude. the backboard, dude. I mean, you saw him get the, just went for the alley Uber right afterwards. No tech in Psycho for Fatality. Remember, guys, this is a top eight set, so it is best three of five. So we're going to jump into this next game here with a 2-0 lead and Tweak in Captain Zack's favor. Off the backboard, man. No tech. That's the importance of teching, man. It's like he, he would have been able to try for to survive sure. another day, man. I cannot believe he got the forward air off that. That was a combo. It looked like he wall jumped tech for a second. I, yeah. I was expecting his tech, but he didn't. He was, just, he, he was in flail. It's tough with the mm -hmm. uh, multi hits of Beach Downer to tell whether or not you have to tech at a certain time. Right. But here we go. Ganon going to be staying on the screen. I think he's a little bit more confident in that. They did pretty well, especially compared to the first game. But the first game is also just straight bonkers on a lot of levels. Oh, yeah, 100%. We go super deep with these PK Thunders. Again, honestly, at this point, Fatality going for these forward smashes, it's not to, like, hit them. It's just to apply shield pressure. Exactly. Whittle that shield down, and then the next t uh, hit you're going to take is either going to break or poke. And it's going to be tough to punish him when his teammates are literally right there as well. So I, I agree with the decision to go for those. Saw Fatality just burying Ness in the face. I think maybe that color coordination could yeah. be throwing him off a bit. Oh, my gosh. And, and yeah, we see Zach being blue again, by the way. So bro move by him. Yeah. A oh, good follow-up from Tweak. Gandorf's off stage with no jump. Not going to be able to drag this tech. Yes. Awesome fatality is life here. Dolphin Slash, due to the fact that it comes out really fast, can be hard to tech as well. Now, big combo damage coming out from Zack against Ganon. Eyes going over to try to assist Fatality. Yep. Give, give us a little bit of breathing room. Support your boys. I like that double jump from uh, Fatality. Obviously, you saw Tweak trying to go super low with that forward air. Facing up his recovery to get back onto the stage. AI dying off stage yet again while Vitaly's just struggling to find any sort of stage control. AI finally assisting him to get back on that platform. Gets the forward air. Vitaly was scheming heavy with those up airs off the stage, really trying to make quick work between stock, but it's not going to pan out. Oh, both of them going to get shielded, or rather, both of them going to shield that forward smash. So all the hits done in the world from it, too. Gets the forward tilt, gives him the little boots. Vitaly's looking for something. 
and dashing back and forth. Wait, he's kind of, honestly at this point he's just waiting for like someone to commit. Gets the counter from Toad. That's gonna be I's second stock already annihilated. Five stocks to two. Ooh. Yeah, this is absolutely brutal. We can Zach, man, showing you why they've made it to this top eight. Yeah, dude. We're looking pretty bleak here, man. Really like Tweet going with Cena, by the way. Yeah, it's a it's a pleasure to watch. Yeah, he just has an interesting take on every character. Oh, so close to ending I with that forward air. Gonna eat a neutral air out of shield, but that's only his first stock. I don't think he's sweating it too hard. AI again, offset because he missed the air dodge onto the ledge. Well, oh, you got fatality. Oh my god, Warlock punch. And I's dead. Aww. And fatality gets back onto the stage. So I try to go for the forward smash and get the roll. Catches him with the down smash. Potential oh, goes for the Okay. He's, all okay. right. I, Going out with he style. He got the clip. He got I the like clip. It. Just I give like it to it. him. Fatality, an absolute savage, man. We saw the double dunk with the Falcon, and then we saw the uh, little kamikaze action right yeah. there with Ganon. Man, actually, yeah, he traded his own stock both mm -hmm. times that he went for those.